In this video, we'll talk about archiving files on a Mac. And we'll go over some of the common problems or questions that you might have, as well as a single convenient solution for an archiving utility. Archiving is indispensable for those who work with a lot of file systems or for those who might not have enough disk space to store things. So what are some problems that you might face while trying to use an archiving utility? Firstly, you can't see the contents of the archive without first unpacking it. Secondly, very often it becomes necessary to add files to an existing archive, which usually isn't doable without an already existing piece of software on your computer. The next thing is the most popular file archive formats are RAR and ZIP formats. And last but not least, we want our files protected. And the tool that combines all of these functions into one beautifully seamless suite is called Commander One. Now, if you hang out until the end of the video, I'll be including a coupon code on screen for 20% off your purchase of Commander One. But let's figure out exactly why Commander One is better than the competition. If you think that built-in compression for Mac is your go-to, then unfortunately you'll be sadly mistaken. A built-in Mac application can help you when it comes to zip files, but anything beyond that, it just can't work with because it's not compatible. You could also use WinZip, which is one of the more popular ones out there, but it's quite expensive. And then you've also got Kika, but sometimes the archiving process can take a long, long time, especially if the file has already been zipped on Windows. Or you could use Hamster Free Archiver, but it doesn't have much in the way of functionality and it can run rather slow, even when you're not doing a whole lot. Where your last alternative is a program called unarchiver, but it can't zip new files into archives. And that means the program's only suitable for extracting archive files and not actually creating new ones. And that's why Commander One is your best solution. It's fast, cheap, convenient, and reliable. In the settings, the user can independently choose the compression ratio and the output file format of the archive. The app is very easy to use and can be customized according to your needs and with support for hotkeys, archiving files becomes even easier. You can press Control alt 5 and see the quick settings window, or for just extracting, it's even easier by just pressing Control f 9 and the files will be extracted in no time. As you can see, Commander One makes it super simple to add a password to any archive that you're creating. And you can simply add another file to an archive that already exists. And double clicking on any of the archives and opening them up in the file explorer will show you the contents of that archive. Commander One also supports so many different third party archive formats that you don't need to worry about running into a type of archive that you won't be able to extract. And as you saw for yourself, how easy it was for me to go ahead and create a brand new archive, open it up to see its contents, password protect it, and then even use third party formats. So if you're looking for an all in one powerful, great priced archiving software, then look no further than Commander One. So as promised, I will now put the coupon code for 20% off your purchase of Commander One on screen right now. Go ahead and head over to their website and plug this code in to get 20% off Commander One for your archiving needs. Be sure to like the video and if you found it helpful, please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications. So be sure to use Commander One for all of your archiving needs. And until next time, thanks for watching.